<laughs> Yo! What's up? Welcome to my channel. Be sure to like and subscribe. Hi. Yes, for this video, guys, I'm gonna try something very different. I'm gonna do a voiceover in the hunting video. So I thought it was a good idea. Enjoy the video, and you better watch this entire video. I worked so hard. Okay, so this was two days before the big hunt. Uh, as you can see, I found some restocks. Uh, finally, after like months and months of not seeing Pokemon cards at all. Um, yeah, I've been going nuts. And then, of course, we have some restocks on the Champions Path Pokemon cards. And, of course, the Vivid Voltage right there. The Booster Packs right there. I did pick up a few of those. And I did pick up a few of the Champions Path boxes. And I was so happy, man. So, so happy. This Target regularly doesn't restock. So, when I saw that... It was nuts. So why not check out the pop section right here? And nothing really so crazy. Um, did find those uh, Twinkie boxes and Target Con shirts. Uh, this was the next day. This is a Walmart that I went to the next day before the actual hunt. And bro, look at all these pops, dude. Holy crap. This this Walmart right here is like, it's kind of like in a small town. So I kind of see why there's a lot of pops in there. A lot of people don't really get into pops. In that area i guess so the, the the stock was pretty big so yeah there's some 10 inch lebrons 10 inch marvel zombies so many cool stuff uh did not pick up anything that day but i was very tempted to pick up that hulk but decided to stop there because the next day was literally the day that i was going to hunt for a lot of funko pop so yeah that's what i did and now guys we're here on the funko pop day hunt 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 and bro Look at this. Look at this entire wall of Funko Pops. New restocks, new pops, as you can see in the video. Like, so surreal. I love watching this Funko Pop wall that Hot Topic has, and it's certainly surreal. Like, oh my God. And then, of course, uh, if I decide to zoom in, <laughs> there you go. Uh, look at the new Marvel Zombie Pops. Look at that Modoc, that Doctor Doom, the Red Hulk, and of course, there's some Friends Pops in there. Pretty, pretty cool, man. Oh, and look, the fruit basket, the fruit basket Puckle Pops right there. Pretty cool. The new SpongeBob, some pops right there. And then here are the little pocket pops right here that look pretty cool. Don't personally collect them too much. I only collect the ones that I really like, but hey, might as well show it off here so you guys can see and all that. And with that, I am done with Hot Topic. Holy shit, man. The rush, the rush of hunting down a pop. And once you get there, it's not there anymore. What am I gonna do with my life? This is not what I pictured when I came back to the Funko game, man. This is this is not it. But it is fun, it's fun. <laughs> and now that we finished hearing Anthony complain the hell out of everything, GameStop, we here we go. All right, so here we got some pops right here. Pretty cool. We got the Beastman 10 inch, some two packs right up there. Uh, right over here, we got some single packs right over here. We got that glow in the dark, Miles Morales, Spider Man. Flareon, Alloy from Breaking Dawn, some more Lucha Libras right there. They were having a cool sale actually. They were having uh, all Funko Pops are $11.99, they were reduced to $9.99. So I did got advantage of some pops right there. And yeah, man, I mean, this GameStop was pretty filled with some cool stuff. And with that, we're done with GameStop. And here's me recording my way to Box Lunch. I was just observing everything, like the mall, like it's so crazy, man. It's so weird the time we live right now. And it feels weird to go to the mall now with this pandemic going on and all that. And I don't know, it was so weird going back to the mall, but hey. And then I found this really uh, weird stop with Funko Pops. I did not trust that, but here we are on Box Lunch. Here we go. Okay, and here we got some Pocket Pops right here. They had a really good selection of Pocket Pops. And then here we got some Funko Sodas that last time I was here, they had some really cool ones, but not anymore. <laughs> So I decided to leave that off. And here, guys, are the Funko Pops they have in this store. And they have some pretty cool ones. Pretty cool ones. Of course, there's a new Deadpool collection. And yeah, man, just a variety of different Funko Pops in here. Uh, we got the Bugs Bunny. We got some Trolls up there. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. We got some Simpsons Pops. That was pretty cool to see in there. And we got some Baymax down there. But I'm guessing that the Chase is not even there anymore. So there's no point in looking. 
Here's the Marvel Zombies again that look pretty cool. The Deadpool collection that looks so dope. I'm not a huge fan, but hey, some of them do look pretty cool. So Miles Morales in there. And then over here, of course, the Simpsons pops. We got Rattata right there. We got an Oscar Mayer Wiener Mobile. And we got a Couch Homer. Hmm. But yeah, that's it for box lunch. And now, guys, we're jumping into Barca Noble. Pretty random. But guys, oh my God. I haven't been to a Barca Noble in a long time. And I love going to this store. There's nobody here. It's so quiet. Like, I could stay here all day just doing nothing, to be honest. Like, so crazy. <laughs> But guys, now we're going to go towards the Funko Pop section. And guys, I'm not going to lie to you. And it's not that great. Um, the, as you can see, there's some Soul Pops right there. We got some Trolls from last year's WonderCon. <laughs> it's pretty crazy, man. We got some Pops right there. We got some Birds of Prey Pops. Like, yeah, man, the selection in this store was not the best that they were a little bit behind but they did have some cool stuff like the, there's some my little pony pops in there we got jj abrams right over there we got ultraman pops we got god of, uh god of war <laughs> game of throne pops and this mina ashido pop pretty cool uh we got some more pops right over here and yeah man that's pretty much it that's pretty much the entire section of funko pops in that store and there was oh oh there's a clearance store right there's a clearance part right here so we got some jumanji pops right here that were like three bucks uh, but yeah nothing really anything crazy here on the clearance section so i decided to go somewhere else uh i did found this section here that has some video game booklets which i totally love uh they have some world of warcraft in there cyberpunk books they got zelda books splatoon 2 uh booklets and i found this guy with a katana what the hell are you doing with the katana in the store man crazy but it looks cool <laughs> all right and then there's some graphic novels here pretty cool some comic books of marvel and dc and then i right over here guys i decided to go to the manga section and, and bro i like the manga section i found this very cool super mario manga pretty cool sick pretty sick pretty sick uh oh my god uh there's some my hero academia mangas in here dude oh my god bro i'm not gonna lie when i saw this section i was literally about to about to take literally one of each but of course a critical time was gonna go broke but yo this section was packed with mangas they had some one piece mangas one punch man mangas jojo mangas we got some whoa whoa what is this man of course it's not a manga with some some anime titties i guess uh ready move move right along demon slayer we got some taco on titan which looked pretty cool and then over here we got some black clover and then we got some blue exorcist and then we jump into a random game stop <laughs> but yeah that pretty much concludes the hunting nothing really crazy in this game stop but yeah guys let's jump into anthony's room to see how much he spent today oh my god oh lord i have went over the line this time <laughs> Oh my god, I don't know what the hell happened to me, man. Today was supposed to be simple, not too crazy, pop hunt. Guys, I have went over the roof today. I have bought so many Funko Pops, and I'm so, so shocked on myself, dude. I was, when I finished shopping and everything, I was like, what the hell did just happen? Okay, I want to get this out of the way. So I can get these pops onto the collection because they're, uh, I, like, <laughs> what the fuck, <laughs> oh my god, are you serious, man, oh my god, let's just get this out of the way, dude, let's, let's get this out of the way, with Hot Topic, we got a bunch of a hot cash that I had and everything, I also had a $5 coupon on my account, purchase this today, so, why not start, this is the concept series, dart vader so i really like the design man really like the design uh did not get the c3po the r2d2 and the yoda because i'm not really a huge fan of those design i really do like dark vader though <laughs> okay now this one i was not going to pick up at all until i saw it in person but once i saw it i was like holy crap it does look pretty cool so my first ever Alice in Wonderland pop, we got ourselves the ECC exclusive Caterpillar. I don't even know when was the last time I saw Alice in Wonderland. I think that was like years ago, man. As soon as I saw it in person, and this was not a pop that I was gonna get first. And like at the beginning when ECC were happening, but I saw it in person, it does look pretty cool, man. It does look pretty nice. 
like uh, I did the one gripe is is that the character is huge in the movie I don't know if you guys remember but he's kind of huge so this would have been was a six inch pop but uh hey I'll take it man it looks pretty cool it's gonna look really good on my pictures on Instagram so pretty cool man I'm very excited for that oh this one I've been very excited for very very excited when I saw this one on the store I kept looking online and it keeps he keeps running out and all that so it was pretty cool to see it in person so guys we got Kurugiri from My Hero Academia pretty nice look at that design of that pop man that's not a pop that is not a pop dude what <laughs> dude this looks so sick man yo it's heavy as too it's heavy as hell too Oh, this guy looks so cool, man. Kurogiri, such a cool character in the anime, man. But guys, we got Kurogiri. Uh, oh, yeah. This is another ECCC pop that I was not going to get until I saw it in person. It's that I like seeing things in person. It makes me uh, think, make a decision really fast. So when I saw this one, basically this Cabbage Patch Kid, uh, Boney Tony. So, bro. When I saw this in person, at first, this is another pop that, like I said, I was not going to pick it up. But when I saw it in person, I was like, yo, it looks so cool. Like, I love the design of the skull and all that. He's like, all zipping his skin. I love that as a design, man. Okay. Okay, guys. The only reason I got this pop, I got a discount. And uh, I'm going to start watching the anime suit. <laughs> I gotta get ready for this anime because it's long as hell and uh i'm gonna get i gotta get ready for it but guys i got myself from one piece eccc exclusive buffed chopper look at that guys the only reason i got a discount on this one is because as you can see there is a huge tear on the box what we're we gonna do about that man and then she gave me a discount on the pop so hey man i'll take it i'll take this is gonna go out of the box anyway, so I really don't don't mind at all. Oh man, he's gonna look really nice on the anime displays right here on the shelf. So hey, pretty nice. I'll take it, man. I'll take it. I got it for a discount. So we got two more pops here. We got two more pops. Modok. Look at that design, man. Look at that design, dude. Such a cool pop, dude. Such a cool pop. Hell man, look at this shit, man. Oh my, it bobbles in that. What? No way. Dude. It bobbles and everything. Oh my God, look at that MODOK. Oh my God, MODOK is one of my favorite villains in the Marvel comics, so I really wanted to get this one as soon as it got announced. And I am gonna start collecting this um this zombie. Like, they look so cool. I prefer way more than the Venom line, to be honest. And the Venom line, I'm not, I'm not I, like, I'm gonna tell you, it looks cool as hell. I do have some of the Venom pops right here, like, like Venom Thanos, uh, Venom, Venomized Green Goblin, the, the Doctor Strange and all that. But this zombie line, yo, this eats the cake, right? It, it eats the cake, dude. It looks so dope. Uh, okay, last pop from um, Hot Topic. Of course, from the same Marvel Zombies line, we got ourselves the Hot Topic exclusive She-Hulk. Look at that, guys. Pretty, pretty nice. I'm very excited to pick up the 10 inch uh, Black Panther zombie Black Panther. That, that one does look pretty nice. So I'm very excited about that. We're going to jump in to GameStop. I'm going to show off two, the both GameStops that I went to today. I'm going to show that off. And then towards the end, I'll show off the box launch stuff. One of this, this, I wanted this for such a long time. Such a long time, man. It's a really cool character. I really wanted it. And the t-shirt looks hella nice, man. It looks hella nice. So we got ourselves, guys, the Super Saiyan 3. Goku box set with the t-shirt, man. Everything that is yellow on the figure, it glows in the dark. That's pretty, pretty nice. Uh, oh, I got this for a discount, too. Oh, man, it looks so cool. It's a heavy figure, too. Okay, this is the from the Avengers game that came out last year, MODOK. Pretty cool. We got another MODOK. Uh, it looks so cool, man. Such a cool pop. I don't know why this pop is so over, like overrated to everybody, man. This pop looks so cool. I want it for literally five bucks. So, hey, man, I'll take it. I'll take it. Such a cool pop. Heavy figure, too. I do like my bulky figures. Uh, yo, I'm not complaining. Yes, I got myself the Winter Soldier. The Falcon and the Winter Soldier show that is coming very, very soon. 
The reason I did not pick up the Falcon is because we're getting a cooler one later on, guys. The Falcon in this line right here, I'm not a huge fan of, but the one that we're getting here, very, very soon, I really like that one a lot. So I prefer to wait out on that one. I'd rather get that one than the one that we got here on this line right here. Uh, this is the GameStop that I went on the mall. So pretty cool. Oh, yes. Okay, yeah, I've been wanting to get this one just for the glow, man. Well, I want to collect every Miles Morales Spider-Man Funko Pops. So guys, we got ourselves the, what is, what's the name of this? The, pro the Programmable Matter Suit. Pretty cool, man. Pretty, pretty cool. I had to pick it up immediately, dude. It looks so cool. Another pop that we got today is we got Alloy from Horizon Breaking Dawn. Look at that, guys. This is one of the pops that I wanted to get from GameStop. So I'm really glad that I saw this today. Another one here. And this, guys, is from the same PlayStation line from The Last of Us, The Clicker. Yo, such a cool pop, man. This is gonna look so sick right next to Ellie right here. The only one I need is Joel. I think Joel is kind of rare. Um, one of the most popular characters in the game. So I kind of get why. The last pop that I got today, guys, for my ongoing growing Thanos collection, guys, we got, this name is so weird, man. We got Thanos from Earth. 18138. <laughs> to be honest with you guys, I have not read this storyline. So I'm kind of confused of this costume right here. The Punisher uh, costume and all that, but I have not read the storyline. But this pop, man, yo, it looks so dope, dude. It's hella dope. And of course I had to get it from my Thanos collection, man. He looks so cool. But yeah, I definitely gotta read that storyline to see what the hell's going on there. Cause what the fuck is he wearing a Punisher? <laughs> Why is he wearing a Punisher suit? Box lunch. Okay, guys, another from the My Hero Academia line. The best genius in town. Pretty, pretty cool, man. This pop looks so sick, man. And this is one of the pops I've been hoping for Funko to make. And they really delivered, man. Pretty, pretty cool. I always wonder what, how they will make it into a pop form. And it looks fucking great, dude. <laughs> it looks so cool. Jumping into another Spider-Man pop. We got these Miles Morales 2020 suit. This is the suit that I've been, been using the entire game from start to finish. Because it's such a cool suit. When, once I acquired it on the game, I basically just kept it. This costume. This is basically one of my favorite costumes in the game. Now we're gonna jump into. I'm gonna tell you right off the bat, guys. I don't collect Deadpool pops because there's so many. I did pick up one of the cool ones that I thought it was like I had to pick this up for the collection, guys. We got the Dino Pool. Now this guy I do recognize because I I have seen him in the comics and all that before. So this pop right here does look pretty cool. Imagine if this pop was a 10 inch pop, dude. Yeah, imagine this thing being a 10 inch pop. Like, yo. And also, it's of course from the 30th anniversary of Deadpool. Pretty nice, man. I really like that. Uh, yeah, pretty cool. So we got Dino Pool. And now we got here a uh, Box Lunch exclusive uh, Venomized Doctor Strange. There is basic, there's already like three different Doctor Strange. There's the common, there's the uh, Amazon exclusive Glow in the Dark one. Now there's this one. So. What the hell, Funko? <laughs> what the hell is going on, dude? I think it's the coolest looking one out of the three. I do have the common one up there because I thought that pop looked so cool when Wednesday first released it. But when they when they announced this one, this one takes the cake, man. I think this one is the best one now. And of course, it does glow in the dark. So I'm pretty excited to open this up to see this, to see the glow and all that. And lastly, from Box Lunch, guys. Box Lunch. Guys, we got Couch Homer from The Simpsons. Deluxe Funko Pop. Pretty cool, man. It's one of the ones that I really, really wanted to get from the line. And I'm so happy that I got this. So we got Couch Homer, man. Pretty nice. My haul from Box Lunch. No, not Box Lunch, from Barnes & Noble. One of the pops that I wanted to pick up from Barnes & Noble was not there, man. It was the, uh, the Glitter Vaporeon ACCC exclusive. They only have the Wonder Woman, which why I was really not into. Uh, I don't know, the design is kind of lacking. But I did pick up another Funko-related item. So, hey man, I'm excited. 
Guys, the My Hero Academia Mystery Minis. Man, man, we're gonna open this right now. We're here. Okay, guys, we gotta open these up. You know the drill, you know the drill. So in this pack right here, this is the first time I buy mini mates. The mystery minis, mystery, sorry about that. It's up real quickly. Uh, here are the figures that you can get. Oh, I gotta open it in my hands. I have no knife here. Oh, okay, let's see. Oh my God, oh my God, it feels so cool. It feels so cool. I like the, I like the, I love gambling. Let's see if we can get a rare. Can we get a hollow or above? I don't care about the box. I don't care about the box. Ooh, oh, is it a black box? Oh, is it a black bag? Hmm, huh, interesting. Let's see. Uh, who could this be? Who could this be, man? Oh, 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 I think I know who this is. I think I know who this is. If, it, if it's this one, I'm gonna, yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Guys, we got the All Might. Oh Lord. All right. If it looks messy here, guys, I'm so sorry. I gotta dust everything here sometimes. Okay, you're going on to the other mystery minis. Oh man, this is going to be a real addiction. Oh my god. We're gonna do this really fast. So we can go back to Anthony, throwing off his item, throwing off his 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 pops. Oh my sorry right here. Alright, let's see. Who could this be? Who could this be? Oh, I think I know who it is. I think I know. Could it be? Who could it be? <gasps> Ooh, we got Froki. This mystery mini looks so cool, dude. That's so cool, man. So guys, we got Froki. <laughs> these were made by Funko, right? These, yeah, yeah, these are from Funko. Okay, I was like a little bit confused. Like, yeah, these from Funko or not? Please, for the love of God, we have had enough hit today. Let's see, what does it say there? Go, go plus ultra. I didn't even notice that. Okay. Let's see. Uh, da, 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 da. Who could this be? Huh. That feels weird. It feels like... It feels like... Tania? But I'm not sure, man. I'm not sure. Let's see who it is. 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 Let's No, 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 this is not what I wanted. <laughs> let's just continue the video. All right, now that we got that out of the way, let's keep on rolling with what I got from the store. I really wanted a pretty manga for the for the collection right here, from my hero collection. And this one does look so dope. We got volume 18. From my hero academia, of course, with we got overhaul right here. Of course, the most like one of the most iconic scenes in my hero academia. Overhaul against 100 percent Deku with Eri. So hey man, it's such a cool cover. It's gonna look so nice up there in the collection, right up there. So yeah, man. <laughs> this book is actually one of my favorite books ever. It's one of the first books that I've ever finished reading. First time ever. And I read this, I think, when I finished high school. Uh, I do like a lot of uh, marketing stuff and all that, so I picked up this book right here. Rich Dad Poor Dad, if you haven't read that, hey man, such a cool book. It's a really cool book, man. Uh, it's about um, investing and all that cool stuff, so hey, pretty cool. So I picked up that book, and I think that's it, it man. If you see this floor right now, it is full of pops, which is a cool look for some people. But if I keep this, co if I keep this going, man, I run out of space so fast. Like, what I do for this shelf right here is as soon as the new pop comes in, I basically take out some of the old one and scatter them around the room or something like that. We're back here. Like, I'm literally making more displays so I can put more future pops in there. <laughs> oh my God. This is insane, man. I need a house. I need a house because, oh my God, I need to move to a house fast. That is it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please give it a like. Keep subscribe. Whatever you want to do, please, 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 please. I'm going to leave a link in the description below for my social medias and all that. A link from Amazon that if you want to purchase some Funko Pops and all that, and you can want to support the channel, please, you're more than welcome to. You're, you don't have to. I'll leave a link in there if you want to pick up some Pops and all that through my link. 
that will support the channel. And yeah, it's pretty cool. Do that, because... Uh, <laughs> I'm so sorry. There's so many, man. There's so many. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please press that link so I can keep purchasing Funko Pop. Please. Bye.